what's up guys y'all know who it is it's your girl bj the real and today i'm going to pick my mother's day gift up to myself nobody bought it i bought it myself i'm going to pick it up because i didn't know she shipped it to the store but she did but i'm also going to take my two um not this pink bag that's gucci but this bag here uh the white demiere print to see if they can clean it for me revive it and i also have the little uh multi the little pochette inside to see if they can clean that one also and the chain is broke so hopefully they're not going to charge me hopefully they're not going to charge me to uh fix it so we'll see let's go Okay guys, as y'all see, I have made it. I have made it, yes. I have arrived. Well, here. I'm this one. No, I'm talking about this one that. What is this? No, I'm looking at how cute. Wait, I know they did. They put this strap. Oh, no, no. Somebody else did this. I know this don't come on this bed. On the cap of Wow. Wow. No, they don't. <laughs> Why do it look so... Huh. Huh. Edward. Now she look cute. what's up everybody it's your girl bj the real and today i'm going to be doing of course an unboxing from my favorite store <laughs> okay um i thought i was waiting on the package to come but somehow she sent it to the store which was not a bad idea because she told me to bring in that bag right there to see if they could clean it. But she said what they basically do is they try to massage the um, leather to try to get it as clean or as bright as they can get it. And um, basically they take the straps off and replace them with new straps. But here's the kicker. Every order that's sent out is a year wait you have to wait a whole year that's the first thing the second thing it costs 600 bucks what okay i'm thinking that's why she sent the bag to the store to get me back into the store i don't know but she's my girl i love her okay i love her her name is Cynt <laughs> cynthia that's her name i love her so much and she's such a great person, guys. She really is. I actually left and went and bought her um, Mother's Day uh, flowers, a, a, bou a bouquet of flowers and um, a little vase with some tulips in it. So I'll show you guys that later. It's in my car. Somebody left it in my car. But anyway. So I got this for my essay. She's so beautiful. I just love her so much. I'll be taking these to her when I get off work. Okay, y'all. One more. And this is it. Look how pretty these are. She gonna like these. 
So those were the flowers that I got her and this was her reply. Now back to our regular scheduled programming. That's not the point. The point is to replace this bag and get it back to it, um, as close as we can get it to a new standards. It's going to take one year and 600 bucks. No, 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 no. I'm good. I'll buy a new one if I have to do that. <laughs> I'm like, no, no, girl. No, I'm good. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> That's way too much money. I can literally buy an entire new bag. Now, I got that bag in 2018. I wore it on... um. I went out the country with it and I bought it for that purpose to wear it out the country. You know, have something comfortable. You can put stuff in, whatever, whatever. But child, ain't no telling what that costed back then in 2018. It probably only costed maybe a thousand bucks, maybe 1200 bucks at the most, maybe 1200. If I can find a receipt, I will. But 600 bucks? Nah. Uh-uh. <laughs> Not at all. But anyway, guys, so yeah, everything that's sent out now to be repaired, you're going to have to wait an entire year for repairs now. I'm good. The pandemic did all that. No, I'm good. I don't need none to be report repaired. <laughs> I'll get another one. So anyway, well, I ended that, up back into Louis today because y'all know I was just at Louis. Like, <laughs> what am I living in here? Okay, I don't have that kind of cash. But anyway, that's why I ended back up in Louis today. I ordered a bag. And um, she shipped it to the store. So, let me get to the unboxing. Once again, guys, this is my unboxing for Mother's Day. It is Wednesday today as I'm filming this video. But this is my video for Mother's Day. My Mother's Day gift. And then I'll come back if I get some more gifts. Hopefully, I get more gifts. But <laughs> here's the bag. Oh, it's a big bag. Here's the bag it comes in. Y'all know I am. I'm just into collecting right now, y'all. And I need to stop because I'll be working so hard to get all the money I can get, okay? And I need to just sit down, okay? So we all know it comes in this orange uh, bag. And it comes in. Let me step back. In this here orange box. Look how big she got this box. Why she didn't put my little tassel on there? See, she got me messed up. <laughs> no, but um, yeah. This is a big, huge box that it comes in. Let's go ahead. Let me step back. <laughs> oh, let me go ahead and unravel it. <laughs> okay, wait. The bag is that this box is so huge guys it is huge come on this bag ain't never that big that this box have to be this big like seriously but anyway back to the video it comes in a magnetic box hey okay well i still think the box is like it's too big i know it's one size down okay we need one size down but anyway here it is comes like that so let me sit this box down and here it is guys oh what's in it because anybody guess anybody guess i'm gonna show some let me insert some clips of me trying on some bags and i need you guys to guess what bag this is look how tiny Wait, let me show y'all how tiny this bag is. I don't know, Cynthia. What can I fit in? Oh my God, wait. Wait, I don't got the ball. This is so cute. How cute is that? Somebody buy me this. There's Ben. He's busy. Okay, and here it is. Here it is. Ah, she's so cute! Here she is, guys! Oh my god! This is the... What my receipt? This is the Speedy 25 
chandelier, of course. Um, okay, it's 18, if you guys can see, this says 1854. 1854 is when Louis Vuitton was first established. And so, we know, we all know what is it, Audrey, however you pronounce her name, um, was the first person that created the Speedy Bag. And so, I wanted this Speedy Bag because I just felt like it was special to the brand. To get the year of um, when Louis first started is like an amazing deal for me. Like seriously, I have so many of the bags, but to get one that actually means something, it, it's like, it doesn't matter if they don't bring it out no more. And I'll tell y'all this, this bag was 23 60 or something like that. It has not had any price increases. So if you want this bag, you better get it. Because not only is it going to be gone, once it's gone, we all know it's gone. I don't think they're bringing it back because she, um, my SA told me she didn't even know that they had it. Like she didn't know that they had the bag anymore, but clearly they had it because somebody, you know, I got it. So clearly they had it. It was somewhere, sitting somewhere. I wish all my hey plastic. Guys, let's look at the inside of it. It comes with um, the strap, and it is an adjustable strap. She has it stuffed because, you know, I like my bags to keep their shape. So she stuffed it for me. And um, it comes with, of course, the keys. And the keys, everybody know that the keys will have the number of the lock on there. So right there it says 609. On that key it says 609. So right there. And of course it comes with the strap and the handles and the outlining is in leather. What kind of leather? I don't, I don't know. I didn't too much do my research too good on the bag, but I thought it was so important for me to have this bag and I'm going to get up and show you guys what it looks like on me. <laughs> and the inside of this bag is in microfiber. You guys see that? It's black. Can you guys really see? Right there. And it is black. But what's so good about this bag, it can go real good with navy. It's looking a little like black and navy, but it's not, it's gray, but it looks, it looks navy for some reason. It's giving off because of those, um, the way that that thread is, is coming off as a navy, but it's black. It's so beautiful. What do you guys think? Is it pretty or what? This is my Mother's Day gift to myself. Let's add it and see what it looks like. I have the adjustable, adjustable strap here. Why do I keep dropping everything? I don't know, I don't get it. This is so like crazy. So, let me show you guys how I like to wear my bag. I don't like to wear them like this, but if I did, this is where it would hang on me, right here. I like cross bodies. So, I like cross body or when it has a tote. So here it is when it's cross body. You guys see? Yeah, baby, here we go. Okay, now, this is how I would wear it. And I will leave the strap hanging just like that. I probably would cuff it to make sure it wouldn't hit the floor because I'm only five feet. So I wouldn't want it to hit the floor, but I would wear it as a tote. And this is how I would carry it. So this is how I would wear it. I would wear it like that. Now, I was being nosy on the website and I seen that the um, bandeau and dough is still available. So I am going to order the bandeau today as well. So. I will be doing a updated video so you guys could see how it looks with the bandeau. But yes, isn't she beautiful? You guys see her? How cute is she? With that gold hardware, she is so pretty. 
Yes, I have arrived. Stop playing with me. Hey, y'all like her, right? Yes. Okay, guys, y'all know I like to do up close and personals. So here it is. The um, the bag was made in France, in Paris. Paris. In Paris, it was made in France. And here's a close up of it. Look at that gold hardware. Okay. There she is, the 1854 Bandolier Speedy, a Speedy Bandolier. Okay, guys, she uh, she also gave me some uh, perfume samples. You guys can see in there, she gave me four. She asked me what was my favorite fragrance, and I'm like, girl, just give me some. I don't really know. But anyway, <laughs> I always get them. Every time I make a purchase, I want some samples because I travel with them and I want samples. I want something free. Period. But anyway, long story short, I thank you guys so much for loving me. And I love you guys so much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, share, send it to a friend. But most importantly, subscribe and click on your notifications so you'll be notified whenever I post a video or a short. I love you guys so much. I am BJ The Real on all social media platforms. Until next time, happy Mother's Day <laughs> to all my beautiful mothers. <laughs> happy Mother's Day to all my beautiful mothers. I hope you guys have a blessed and beautiful Mother's Day. I hope you guys get something really special because I know you deserve it. Because us as mothers, the job that we take upon, people will never understand. Especially if you don't have children. You will not understand the struggle and what it's like to have all these. And if you have multiple children, all these different personalities that you have to attend to on a daily basis. Every day is a full-time job. So, I want to thank all of my mothers so much for being amazing and being great. And that is to the great mothers. Okay, not if your grandma watching your, your child all the time. I ain't talking to you. Okay, I'm talking to my beautiful mothers. I love you guys so much. And if no one told you today, happy Mother's Day. You're hearing it from BJ The Real. Happy Mother's Day. I love you guys. Uh, one more thing, even though I have so many bags in my collection, I want to let everybody know that this is my first Speedy bag. My first Speedy I have Boston bags, which is from Gucci Collier's Boston, but from actual, from Louis Vuitton, this is my first Speedy ever. <laughs> How ironic is that? Of the one Speedy, my first Speedy, I have so many of these Alma BBs, but when it comes to the Speedy bag, because it was so common, I think that's why I never reached for it. It was so common, everybody has them. And I kind of, you know, want to stay away from every what everybody else has. But you can't. Like, everybody have everything. So, my first Speedy, guys. Yes. And it will not be my last, but it is my first. Wow. First Speedy. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I appreciate you guys to the utmost. I am, once again, BJ The Real. Until next time.